We are all aware of uh, what is perhaps the biggest menace right now facing our residents, and that's potholes. Each and every one of us have gone over one or a dozen, or like me, probably hundreds. Uh, we try our best to avoid them, and sometimes it's, it's very hard. We all know that this has been a very difficult winter, and in a very difficult winter where we've had a lot of storms, that's created a lot of potholes. Now, I want to I want to be clear. We had a great response for snow removal, and we are having a great response to repair the potholes in the roads. Already, we've had hundreds of potholes repaired. Our supervisor uh, and uh, superintendent of highways, Tony Sharon, are out there. They're looking at which potholes need to be repaired first. We're prioritizing them and we're filling them. We had the local plant that uh, makes the finer material to fill potholes open this week, which was why a lot of the work couldn't have been done before. But then again, we see what the uh, fluctuations of the weather are. As we see tonight, at the end of March, we have a snowstorm. And another snowstorm, if we're gonna have more, it's gonna create more potholes. We're doing everything we can to keep up with it. Uh, I do wanna commend our highway department and all our highway workers for going out there and doing all they can to fill up those hundreds of potholes. We're gonna fill up every single pothole in this town. And that's a guarantee from this town board and from the, uh, from the superintendent of highways. So I do wanna commend again. I want to uh, request your patience, but also let you know and update you on the work that's going on in, that, in this town for that, uh, for that uh, project as well. Thank you.